So just to start with a small background, 50 to 60 years back, uh, there were smoking was not thought to be associated with cancer. And then we realized that definitely smoking is an important cause for cancer. And now everybody is aware about this association with smoking and cancer. Another important substance which is on the rise uh, use in nowadays, every party, every function, every conference has this. And still we are not aware that this is also an important cause of cancer. And that is alcohol. So did you know that alcohol is now officially recognized and is an important cause of several cancers? And most of us are still unaware of this risk. So today to break down uh, to you about these, about this risk of association of alcohol and cancer, we'd like to uh, discuss this with uh, our guest today, Dr. Vidya Sagar, sir. So just to start off, uh, there are some new recommendations saying that risk of alcohol and cancer. What is this all about? Can you just explain to us? Uh, thanks for inviting me uh, on this uh, kind of a forum to discuss this very important topic. So, yes, uh, previously people recognized, as you rightly alluded, that the tobacco industry, people said, okay, tobacco may not be responsible for cancers. Then it became very evident and there's no doubt about it. It causes lung cancers and predisposed to certain other cancers as well in the oral cavity and so on and so forth, larynx, pharyngeal cancers. Now, uh, the myth about alcohol is that many people thought it was protection to the heart. Then they came about rise in liver diseases. Then they said, oh, alcohol uh, can cause liver problems. And now increasingly, uh, most of the Western countries where alcohol consumption is very high, they have started realizing that the cancer is on the rise. When they've tried to find out why cancer is on the rise, when they've looked at the various potential causes, alcohol has stuck out like a sore thumb. And they have now realized that there is no safe limit of alcohol. Even a small amount of alcohol, even from the first drink itself, your risk starts to accumulate to cause cancers. So that's the reason why it is very important. Recently, uh, the US uh, Health General uh, uh, issued a public uh, advisory uh, to the rising incidence and prevalence of cancer in the United States based on a large population study which took place between the year 19, uh, 2019 to 2020 when they looked at about 100,000, that is 1 lakh cancers in the US was just attributable to alcohol of which 20,000 people died. That is one in five people died because alcohol was the leading cause of cancer. 